Hey guys, what's up? And welcome to Movie Money episode number 42. So for this episode of Movie Money, the movie I'm going to talk about, as you can see by the title below, is called Kingsman, The Secret Service. Now, people have been bugging me, messaging me, telling my friend William Mancini that I should go see it, and guys, thank God I saw it, because it's a, a really good movie. I mean, I love the action in it, I love the actors in it, and I love the plot in, in this movie, The King's Men and Secret Service. I mean, it's not your average action movie. I mean, this action is like went above and beyond. Like, there's these couple scenes, well, first, before I get into that, there will be spoiler alerts in this movie Monday. So, if you guys don't want to hear, click away, click away, click away. I'll give you guys five seconds. Go. Alright. Looks like you guys are still there. So, that's the scene I was talking about in the church. Where, um, the British guy was taken over by, like, technology. He was killing everyone in sight. I mean, that was so epic. I loved that scene. I can watch that scene over and over and over again on YouTube. That's the kind of action I like. That I can see it over and over and over again and still be so amazed by it. Now, I want to go into the acting. So, there's these two actors I like to mention. First, Colin Firth. As you can see by the picture right here. He's a good British actor. He's been in a lot of movies, but the movie I recognize him the most is What a Girl Wants, where he played the father who ran away or whatever. Like, he's a very good actor. You can feel the emotion he's bringing to you. And, yeah, he's a good actor, and he's British. I just had to throw that out there. Like... You probably found out that James Bond is also a British movie, but this movie, The Kingsman, really helped people who are British, like, British acting. I don't know how you say that, but, yeah. He's a good actor, but my favorite actor in this whole movie was, of course, Samuel L. Jackson. As you can see by the picture right here. Yeah, he's been in more movies than... Basically, everyone who's been in the movie, more than every actor, that's what I've heard. And he was in one of my favorite best among movies where I talked about in a, future, in a previous movie Monday, and that was Coach Carter. And he's a very good actor. I love his voice. I love his intensity. I love his emotion, what he brings in. He's just a great actor overall. I wish I can see all of his movies that he was in, but if I did that, it will probably take me probably a month to see every single movie he's been in. Like, I've heard it's like somewhere around 50 or 100, I don't know the exact number, but he's been in like so many movies, and he's such a great actor. I want to see him again. For The Kingsman, I recommend this movie. It's also very funny. They had funny scenes, but the action helped this movie go over the top. And the acting helped it go over the top. Like, I would definitely watch this movie again. And I want to like to give a shout out to my bro, William Mancini. Like, if it wasn't for him bringing this movie, I wouldn't have been doing this movie Monday with you guys. I would have been talking about another movie, which I don't know. But... Yeah, you guys, thank you for pushing me to go see this, and thank God I saw it, and I would definitely see it again. Now, my good friend John Pesser, he also saw the movie with us. He said it was good, but the violence, it was too violent at times. Like, I can see where he's going with that, but the action and the violence brought this movie to where it would be. So, I'll give this movie an 8 out of 10. It was that good. I loved it. I would definitely see it again. And, like, I encourage you guys to go see it. Go buy it on Blu-ray. Go buy the DVD or go online and watch it. You have to watch this movie. Like, 
just that good. I can't wait to see it again. Alright, so I think that concludes this episode for Movie Monday. So, yeah. Subscribe for more content. Social media links in the description below. And yeah. MK out.